Hello everyone, this is me Luit and you are watching me on my YouTube channel East Indian Explorer. Welcome to a new episode. So today is uh, Thursday. I forgot the date. Sorry about that. I am on the National Highway 37 right now. As you can see, looking at the condition of the road, it's full of potholes. And today I am riding to Tejpur to get the first servicing of my bike done. I have already done somewhat 15 kilometers out of my home and uh, 35 to 40 kilometers have left for my destination which is Facebook. The service center guys asked me to reach the service center by 9.30 am but uh, I got out from home at uh, 8 past 45 but it's already 9.30 and I have already done somewhat uh, uh, 15 to 20 kilometers. This is because of this road condition. On this patch, after crossing Samoguri towards Boliabor, the road condition has slightly improved. Not much, slightly. I have reached the Koliabot in Yali and now I have to take the left diversion towards Tejpur. So I have done 38 kilometers. From here, Tejpur is uh, 15 to 20 kilometers. Till some days back. This Koliabot Tejpur road was in absolutely good condition but uh, that day when I took my bike back from the showroom on the date of delivery itself I was so disappointed to see the condition of the road. This has even degraded as of now. Okay guys as soon as I am moving forward the weather is changing dramatically. I mean the wind blowing is getting cooler and cooler and this is so much refreshing I can't express you. This is happening because I am going nearby Brahmaputra river which is the largest river in entire northeast. Okay, this is the entry point of the bridge from Koliabor side. There is a small shake post. And we are on the bridge. Numerous potholes welcome you to Tesbur Town. Okay, guys, this is Porvacha really. I have to take this left turn now. 
and that test boot down and the uh, showroom is somewhat 3-4 km from this spot the road is very wide that's why there is not much traffic jam on this road unlike the roads on Naga town of course the roads on Naga town is so narrow even on the highway there exists uh, lots and lots of traffic jam towards my right there is Dorong college it's an old and very prestigious college of Deshpur town and it's famous in throughout Assam okay guys this is Mahabharata temple, famous Mahabharata temple. There is the service center. Okay, I have this See you soon. Okay, guys, I am at the service station of SK Bazaar. Those are the bikes behind me. My bike is down there. It is being washed, and after that, the servicing will be done. Uh, it's been like half an hour since I am reached here, and after some time, the servicing will be done, and I'll be out from here. Okay, guys, this is the waiting area. My bike has been washed, and now it's waiting for its turn. It's number 9. After some time, the servicing will be done, I guess. The servicing has been completed and now the lamination process is going on. I haven't done the lamination when I took the delivery but now it's this guy is doing the lamination. So after this is done, I will be up from here. This service center guys have done a great job. So thumbs up for SK Okay guys, the servicing and the lamination process has been completed and Just gave the gate pass and right now the bike feels as good as completely new. The clutch was a little hard, not hard actually, but right now it feels even lighter after the first servicing. The thing is that one of my friends, Tanvir Rahman, he asked me to wait for some time. He said he wants to meet me. Uh, he is the guy who helped me in getting this bike from Tejbur showroom. Uh, I didn't even uh, book this bike previously while taking this delivery. Uh, he had someone who he knew in the showroom. He asked that guy to keep one bike for me. With his help only, I have been able to get this bike. Tanvir, if you are watching this video, then Thank you very much man, without your help I wouldn't have been able to get this bike so soon, right before ZST. The bike feels so smooth after the first servicing, just loving it. The SK Bazaar showroom service center guys have done a really great job. I am full satisfied with the servicing they have done. So thank you, a big thumbs up for SK Bazaar's Tispur. After the servicing it feels like the bike pulls even harder than before now and that in a smooth way ok guys <clears throat> so met my friend Tanvir Rahman and uh, had my lunch so now I am riding back to home Nogao which is 
approximately 57 kilometers from here. Wow, the bike feels so smooth right now. It was smooth even before, but after the servicing, this feels even more smoother. It's only 2 o'clock in the afternoon and I am already back after the servicing. So this feels great. It shouldn't take me any longer than one and a half hour to reach my home. Okay guys, reach the bridge again. Okay guys, I have just reached Amoni and I have taken this left diversion in order to avoid the National Highway 37 which is full of potholes. I have come on this road which will take me through beautiful tea gardens and beautiful wood views and the road is very 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 good. here to have a small photo shoot just look at the view just loving it but the, the curious people here looks at you in such a way like you are from another planet stopping here and clicking photos
guys just reached Nanoit Estate and it seems to be drizzling a bit. A heavy rain might start very soon. Don't know what's going to happen next, but there are a few dark clouds on the sky above my head. Okay, again rain. Shit. Okay, it rained quite a bit. The rain made all my clothes wet. I had to stop and uh, take shelter on a tea stall. I had a cup of tea and uh, after waiting for 20 to 25 minutes, now finally the rain has stopped. And uh, I am. If it doesn't rain, then I should be reaching my home in 10 to 15 minutes. I hope it doesn't rain. Please don't rain. The joy of riding on this road is very, 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 very good. This bike gives fantastic confidence to lean on corners. Okay guys, from this spot to my home is 3 kilometers. So, I am going to end this video over here. If you like watching this video then give it a little thumbs up. I will make a complete detailed ownership review of this bike very soon. To watch that stay tuned and if you are new then hit the subscribe button for me. It helps the channel to grow a lot. Thank you for watching this video guys. I hope you liked it. Ride safe and ride responsibly.